Hello everyone. The name of the game is Nim. Here's one version of the game of Nim. The game is played with 17 counters. Players take turns removing one, two, or three counters from the group. The player who eliminates the last counter is the loser. There is a winning strategy. Well, if there's one counter when it's your turn, you're guaranteed to lose. But if there's two, you can take one and win. If there's three, you can take two and win. If there's four, you can take three and win. But if there's five, you can't win. The most you can take is three. So if there's five, and it's your opponent's turn, you can win. But how do you guarantee your opponent is left with five? Well, leave them with nine. Because if you take one, they take three. They take two, you take two. They take three, you take one. Same thing in there with 13. You leave them with nine. Same thing with 17. So as long as your opponent goes first, you need to make sure that the number of counters that you, you take and your opponent take add up to four, and you'll win. What if they say you go first? Well, you should take one and hope your opponent doesn't take three. Try to leave them with 13. If you can, try to leave them with nine. If you can't, try to leave them with five. The word nim itself comes from the German word nehmen, which means to take. But if you take the word nim and turn it upside down, you get win. Nim is sometimes referred to as the game you can always win. Bye.